Hi Aquarius and welcome to your spiritual tarot advice for August 2018. This tarot reading is intended to help those of you who believe um, that you're on a spiritual journey this lifetime and you're here for you know to help humanity or you're just having a deep spiritual awakening this reading will help you um, see what energies you're dealing with in August and also this reading can be used for those of you seeking guidance on a specific situation or relationship but looking at it from a spiritual perspective okay so Aquarius let's see what the overall energy is that you are working with for August um, in a spiritual sense. Okay, so looks like we have two cards here. We have the sixth ray of devotion and trust in the plan. Um, with these two cards coming out, Aquarius, I feel that you know, this August is a month of faith and uh, your belief in the universe, your belief in destiny, your belief in God, you know, how whatever you connect to, uh, it's like there's been a lot of things happening, taking place that you may not have understood or that may happen and take place over August and you're like, what? That is just not even... I didn't see that coming or that didn't seem like that's part of the plan or that's even the way, but you know, with the sixth ray of devotion, this is like we need to fall back on our belief system. And also with this, if you see how he's falling on his knees and he's praising, things are going to work out in such a way that you can't see right now through your struggle, through your challenge, you know, through whatever's happening. There's an outcome here that you're just not in the right vibration as we start August to see. But it is there. It will play out. You are going to be incredibly grateful for it where, you know, if you did doubt, you did question, um, it's like you're going to have guilt in your heart for that. And I'm sorry, universe. I'm sorry, God. I'm sorry, Jesus. You know, whatever you believe in, okay, it's like you will be filled with the regret and guilt because you are going to say, I had no idea this is how it was all going to play out. So here is the universe at the start of August saying, Aquarius, trust in the plan that I have set before you for this month and the way everything's going to play out for you because by the end, you're going to be very happy grateful and satisfied okay the end result is where the glory is here so trust all right um, <clears throat> oh why won't they stay okay there we go so let's pull a card to uh, gain a bit more information about this energy Aquarius okay well there's two that flew out we have the web weaver synchronicity divine intelligence cause and effect oh my goodness yes and this is card four trust in the plan which is card 13 that would be a four so yeah this goes right there with that and oh my god look at this is card 11 spirit communication paying attention Aquarius listen no matter what's going on, the universe is walking with you. The synchronicities, the signs you're receiving, the urges that you feel that just seem like, what? I, that doesn't even seem, trust it. You are being very much communicated with by your spirit guides through um, August. And there's tons of synchronicities happening all around you. Uh, pay attention to them, Aquarius. Pay attention, pay attention. Oh my gosh. I um, absolutely love these two cards coming out with these two cards, the Hawk Prince and the Web Weaver. It's like beautiful things are unfolding, Aquarius. And if you only see a piece of the whole design or you know a fraction of the whole plan you can't possibly fathom the end okay you can't so instead of pushing against worrying about feeling bad nope through all of august you just say i trust you universe i know you're leading me to my highest good what do i need to do next what do I need to do next, all right? You've got to be participational. You've got to communicate back 
what do I do next? Show me the sign. Show me the synchronicity. Show me the cause and effect of my energy, my behavior, my action. Wow, beautiful, Aquarius. Um, I'm just going to pull a card here to get uh, more information about where specifically this is. It's just like trust in the plan. Do not question things and reach out to your spirit guides. They will show you the way and signs and synchronicities. My goodness. Ooh, look at that. We have thought. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, Aquarius, listen. If you are prone to pessimism, um, thinking negatively, you know, anything like that, it's we've got to get rid of that. Um, if you have been having a lot of self-esteem issues, not believing in yourself, insecurities, a lot of just contradiction and conflicting thoughts and emotions within you, August is trying to, like, shake all of that out, okay? And so with trust in the plan, with these cards here, you need to become very disciplined of what's going on in your mental body in the month of August because I feel a lot of like restriction, obstacle, and challenge that you experience has a lot to do with your mental body and what's going on there and maybe some insecurities and fears that you might not even be aware of. Yeah, look at this, answering the call. You really need to pay attention to your thoughts. Aquarius and what are they are you do you say you're a positive person just because you think that about yourself pay attention take an inventory of your thoughts are they positive are they negative are we noticing our blessings and counting them <laughs> are we noticing our blessings and counting them all right prayer feather flies out as I'm saying that Okay, so let's see what Native Spirits have to add. Spirit of Water. Also the emotional body, Aquarius. What's going on in those emotions? Because the thoughts and the emotions are both connected. Tribal Spirit Dancer. And Owl Medicine. Wow, look at that. Uh, Aquarius. Yes. You, first of all, you guys are incredibly psychic and you need to trust yourself more. But I think some of you guys are having a really hard time distinguishing between your intuition or like insecure thinking. And um, with this spread of cards here, I feel we need to start reaching out to our spirit guides a whole lot more. Um, maybe don't so much think about like all of the things you feel that you're sensing intuitively more or less kind of shelf that and ask your spirit guides to show you and I feel that through August you will see how right you are where you are right about things and then where you know it's uh, deep-seated insecurities in your subconscious mind bringing forth those energies. It's like, but you've got to observe for yourself, okay? You've got to observe your emotional body. You've got to observe your mental body. You've got to observe your intuition and then set all of those things aside and then kind of watch life play out as you ask your spirit guides to help you and you will see the connections and you will then be able to distinguish between the confusion and for me intuition is always just kind of like that nagging feeling that you want to go away it's like you almost don't want to deal with it and insecure uh, thoughts are you know something that's really going on in my mind that's causing me a great sense of worry and nervousness like because I just don't know and I think this is what it is but I don't know like that that's insecurity to me so let's see uh, okay what your spirit guides have to add to all of this look at that crown chakra I know I am part of source and my life is guided by the divine yeah there's somehow some way some of you have gotten really confused between your intuition, your your like ability, and some sort of insecurity, okay? It could be a situation or just the way things have been playing out that's really kind of thrown you off balance, but 
listen, connect the dots for yourself and, um, you know, pay attention to your emotions, pay attention to your thoughts. We have the blue and the red here, and like we have the blue and the red here, uh, the emotions and the thoughts to me. Okay, and um, some of you, you don't know how psychic you are. And this month is a month to help you see that. I mean, we have the sun there, the sun there, the sun there, the sun coming out of, you know, the master here and trust in the plan. He, there's sunlight coming down on the hawk prints here. Yes, there's many things coming to light for Aquarius in the month of August uh, in regards to you know, your spirituality or looking at things from a spiritual perspective, Aquarius. Uh, it's just get those thoughts and emotions under control. No matter what's happening, we've got to trust in the plan. There are signs and synchronicities coming at you. Warp speed, your spirit guides are right there. I mean, with the hawk prints, sp spirit communication, paying attention. Um, some of you don't know how psychic you are, don't know how right you are about things. And uh, August is the month that's about to show you that. And I feel your own thoughts and emotions are kind of what holds you back from seeing the whole picture, okay? But by the end of August, I just feel like you guys are in a really good place. So um, let's pull one final card from your spirit guides to get advice on how to navigate these energies we have boundaries so yeah i think a lot of people's energies and thoughts and opinions and vibrations are what's causing all this confusion and conflict for you and there's certain relationships <clears throat> and situations in your life where you need to create boundaries Aquarius because they're taking way too much from you they're jacking up your energy and that's what causes all this confusion and so um, and put you in that negative thinking mode alright so again ask your spirit guides kind of put your emotions and your thoughts on the shelf and ask your spirit guides to show you and then as you start to see everything you're gonna realize how right you've always been and how it's other people that are creating the confusion and the conflict inside of you okay so trust in the plan it will be beautiful by the end pay attention to the signs and synchronicities uh, based on this reading and some of you are going to learn just how psychic you truly are this month so those are your messages Aquarius I'm wishing you all the best take care